previously on The Next Step. It's a text message from Talia. Wes, there is not enough chocolate in the world right now for this text message. I've got to get over Talia. But why would she text me? I have to have the surgery immediately. Everything in my life was going so well. And then this happens. I saw what you did. I saw you kiss Elfie. Oh, no. If you were here, none of this would be happening. Piper, what are you talking about? Piper needs me. KO, you got to take my spot, man. I'm out. Family is more important than any competition. James is gone. We're gonna be fine. It's fine. With James gone, Eldon has to take his spot in the 2v2 challenge. I know he's nervous, but you can do this. All he needs to do is take a deep breath and calm down. Just relax, okay? We've danced together a million times. As long as we keep it cool, okay? Yeah. We're gonna kill this competition. Yeah, yeah, we, we got this. Yes, we got it, man. We got it. We got it. Okay. We got it. Yes. Yes. We're gonna kill this, man. Yes. Woo! Okay. Boom. I bust a few moves to get Eldon dancing. A little distraction goes a long way. He's kind of like a puppy dog. Mmm, get it. Ah, ah, ah. Hey! Ah. Woo! Woo! Oh, is that James? It's Talia. Hold on, it's who? It's Ali. Talia. Go, Here. In England. Coming to see me. <laughs> I think my brain just broke. Right now, I'm leaving a note for Riley because I'm going to miss rehearsal today. Noah's getting out of surgery, and I have to be there. <laughs> hey, Amanda. Hey, um, Linda. <laughs> I found him wandering the halls. He says he knows you. My cousin Cooper is visiting from England. This whole visit, it's been next step this, next step that, and he's kind of driving me crazy. I know you're following me. Well, it's not that bad to follow in the footsteps of my amazing cousin. And ever since he's watched the next step at internationals, he's become a huge fan. Honestly, I think you should just go home. But the thing is, no one's at home. They've all gone to Niagara Falls. So I thought, why not stay here at the studio and spend a day? I don't really think it's a good idea. I have to go to the hospital and see Noah. I'm not going to be here. Michelle could look after me. Yeah, I'll take care of him. Don't worry, he won't bug anyone. Right, Cooper? Yes, you go indeed. Fine, don't make me regret this. Don't worry, you won't. Thanks. <laughs> no one loves the next step more than Cooper. Today, he's going to have the time of his life. Somehow, Talia found out I was in England for bangers and mashups, and now she wants to see me, like, like, today. What am I going to do, man? I mean, what if she brings Bart back? All right, you really need to relax, all right? Focus. Who's that? It's James. All right, James is already stressed out enough, okay? So don't tell him anything about what's going on with you, all right? Okay. Just, and don't mention anything about Talia. Okay. Nothing. Hey, big guy. Hey, James, what's going on, man? <laughs> what's up, big guy? <laughs> Look, sorry for bailing. Oh, I, got it, got it, got it. I know you guys are going to be all right. It's all good, man. I mean, like, you think someone's gonna be okay without you, and then they're not okay without you, and then they give you a call, and they want to see <laughs> Hey, man, uh, Eldon is just really excited about this competition. Uh, yeah, have a safe flight. Good luck with your sister, and uh, we'll talk to you later, all right? All right, peace. Hey, no more chocolate for you, all right? You need to get your head in the game, all right? We got a competition to go to. My mind is blank. What am I gonna say to her? What's it, Sally? You... <laughs> Why not try hello? Yeah, Wes, that's not helping. Eldon and I have to compete. And if he can't pull himself together, then... 
Might as well forfeit the competition. Noah got out of surgery a little while ago, and I'm just keeping him company until he wakes up. <sighs> Noah. Amanda. Hi. Hi. Has the doctor said anything about the surgery? The doctor came by earlier when your mom was here and said the surgery was successful. Oh. Good for them. Here, have some water. I don't want a man to see me like this, at my weakest. I've never been a fan of the sippy cup. I like glasses or I'll even drink out of a mug. Noah seems so helpless right now. Luckily, he has me here to take care of him. So why this place was changed its name? Well, the owner of this place is absolutely crazy. She, every time she goes on vacation, she comes back with a new name. Like first, she went to Orange County and she named it Squeeze. Squeeze. And then she lived in Tokyo for a month and named it Culture, Culture Shock. And then after that, she went horseback riding in Spain and she named it Hidalgo's. And then last year she went to Columbia and named it Java Junction. And apparently next year, she's supposed to go to space. Space, that's insane. That's cool. That, that's Riley. Introduce me. Actually, don't. Don't introduce hey, me. Hey, Riley. Oh, play it cool. When I see Riley in the flesh, oh my goodness, like, it's actually her. This is Amanda's cousin, Cooper. Hey. Cooper, this is Riley. Nice to meet you. You're Riley, right? That's so cool. Um, I have to go to the hospital to visit Noah, and I was wondering if you could show him around. I'm not in the best headspace, but showing Cooper around would be a great distraction from everything that's going on with Alfie right now. A tour from Riley, he's here. <laughs> So, what do you want to see? Well, I'd really love to meet James. Oh, uh, he's, um, he's actually overseas right now. Oh, too bad. You must miss him a lot. I miss him, man. I don't even know him. Yeah, no, um, I definitely miss him. Do you want to do, do that tour? Yeah. So, is James right left-handed? I'm left-handed. Um, what's his favorite move? Um, does he like pistachios? Here. You know I can feed myself, right? Yeah, I know, but the doctor said you need to rest, and that includes your arms. Mm. Doesn't that mean my jaw, too? Like, eating? I should probably rest that, too. Your jaw's fine. Yeah? Yeah. Hmm. I'm supposed to be your boyfriend, not her baby. Yeah, I, ha I have an idea. I have an idea. Can you go and get me some fast food, maybe, like a burger or a pizza? No, no, you don't want that. Mm -hmm. No, no, no. No, it would really mean a lot to me if you left the building. I mean, if you left the whole building to get me some food. Okay, well, there's a Thai place around the corner. Oh, no, no, much further. Uh, I mean, ribs. Ribs would be amazing. Okay, for you, I'll go. Thanks. The more Amanda sees me like this, the less she's gonna think of me. The longer Amanda is gone, the better. There she is. This is the first time I'm going to see Talia since she left me for Poland. Hi. Hey. Hi. Hi. Oh, my goodness. Hey, Talia. Hi. How are you? Good, how are you? Good, great to see you. So nice to see you. I was actually just about to leave. Oh, OK. Well, yeah. then I'll catch you later. OK. Um... Bye. Bye. Hey, Alden. Uh, OK? Talia's like a hundred, like a thousand times more beautiful than I remembered. Seeing her, it's like I've forgotten how to speak. Amanda went to get me some takeout food, so this is my one chance to go to the bathroom with some dignity. Man, this crossword is tough. What's a seven-letter word for too much water? Urinate. No, nurse, I swear these are from the cafeteria. Oh. Hey, babe. What are you doing lying the wrong way on your bed? Oh, the doc said to elevate my feet, so... Okay, let me help you up. Uh, I'm good, I'm good. Oh, you poor thing. Now I'm a poor thing? Really attractive. Okay, you know, you want just, just stop. I'm good. I'm fine. I got it. Thanks for the ribs. No, I'm just trying to help. I don't want any more help. You're just smothering me. I'm sorry. I, 
I guess I'll be in the waiting room if you change your mind. Well, I won't change my mind, because smothering is smothering. What's a five-letter word for foolish? I'm an idiot. That works. I was so worried about looking weak in front of Amanda that I ended up looking like a big jerk instead. Support the right leg, okay? Please, I'm sorry. Hey, you're probably distracted. I, I couldn't possibly guess what that's about. We should probably just focus on dancing, Piper. <laughs> I'm always focused on dance. What about you, Elfie? My patience for Piper is wearing pretty thin right now. Sure. Uh, hey, guys. This is Cooper. He's visiting from England, Amanda's cousin. Great. Piper, Alfie, and me, all in the same room. Cooper, this is Piper, James's sister. Hey, nice wow. to meet you. You look exactly like him, but in a bit more girly way. <laughs> Wait, your hands touch James. That means my hands have touched James. That is so sick. My hands have touched James too. <laughs> really? Who else's? Turns out this little distraction is gonna be a big headache. Hey, Cooper, you have to meet Elfie. Everyone loves Alfie, isn't that right, Riley? <laughs> um, yeah, yeah, he's great. <laughs> like, a lot. <laughs> well, I bet you miss James, right? I certainly do, yeah. I, I call him all the time to talk about important things. Riley, don't you have an important thing to talk to him about? Have you made that call yet? I don't know how long I can keep this up. I need to pass Cooper off to somebody else so I can just get the heck out of here. Henry! I have been looking for you everywhere. Really? Yeah. I need you to do something for me, okay? Sure. Cooper over there is from England, and he needs to be shown around the studio. Do you think you could do that? Yeah. <sighs> Amazing. Thanks so much. Go for it. Don't forget to call him today. Piper gave me an ultimatum to call James and tell him about Alfie. But I haven't been able to bring myself to do it yet. Oh, how you been? I've been great. I've been touring, dancing, dating, you know. Dating? Yeah, yeah, like lots of girls, like a, a lot, a lot of girls, like at least nine girls, you know. Ever since you left me for Bartek, no, I've just no, been kind of Eldon, Eldon, I didn't leave you for Bartek. What? Eldon, I told you this already. I went to Poland to dance and reconnect with my family. So you and Bartek never dated? No, we didn't even go on one date. Yeah, I didn't date anyone either. Yeah, I know. When you left, it crushed me. It totally broke my heart. I'm really sorry. I really didn't mean to hurt you. I was just starting to get over you, and now you're here. Well, I hope you're not over me, because I'm not over you. I love you. Hi, I'm Eldon. Nice to meet you. Oh. Eldon? Do you have chocolate? <sighs> okay, okay. You're really pretty. <sighs> well, that went well. Eldon fainted three times. Telling Eldon I love him could have gone a lot of ways, but I didn't see this one coming. Hey, Amanda. Hey. Um, do you know which room Noah's in? I was just gonna go see how he's doing. Uh, he doesn't really wanna see anyone right now. Uh, is something wrong? Did his surgery not go okay? Oh, no, 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 the surgery went well. Oh. It's just his attitude. He told me he doesn't want me to be there when he's recovering. Classic. What do you mean? Well, I kind of went through the same thing when I got my tonsils out. I literally looked like a chipmunk for a week. <laughs> and I didn't want to see my friends, because then they would just see me looking like a chipmunk. And he's probably just going through the same thing. He's always been a proud person. He just doesn't want you to see him like this. I never thought of it like that. But Rochelle's right. I can understand where Noah's coming from. And I think I have an idea. Wake up! Hello? 
Ah, all right. So how'd it go? How do you think it went? How long has he been out? 40 minutes. I can't wake him up. One second. Elton. I'm glad West is here. Maybe he knows how to wake Elton up. <sighs> Hold on, so you said 40 minutes? That's insane. Uh, oh, it's not doing anything. Three, two. I love you too. When Eldon tells me he loves me, I'm so happy. I'm never gonna let anything come between us again. So is there anything else that you wanted to do while you are here? Well, the one thing was dance in Studio A. Be my guest. Sick. Show me what you got, Coopster. This is so amazing. When I take my coat off and step onto that floor, I feel some sort of energy and it's so amazing. Like, it's unreal. What I find fascinating about A Studio is that all the greats have danced there is definitely better than anything I imagined. Yeah. It's a special thing watching someone's first dance here. I can really tell that Cooper's feeling all the magic. Let's go, Cooper! I'm trying moves that I've never even done before. I've never done a double flat backflip tuck in my life. What we call that move here is a backhand, backhand, back tuck. <laughs> oh, <laughs> sorry, I know I'm not in a troop. Oh. No, no, that's totally fine. That was actually amazing. Really? You could be dancing here someday. <laughs> that is so oh, cool. Okay. Yeah. When Riley comes out after my dance and says that I could be in A Troop, I definitely have something to push to. I want to be in A Troop one day, and it's going to happen. Keep up the good work. Thanks. <laughs> got a bright future ahead of you. <laughs> anyway, I got places to be. So did you have fun today? Yeah, I had the time of my life. That's amazing. Good to hear. But there was one thing that I noticed. What's wrong with you and James's sister? It, it is, there is something going on, but it's um, personal stuff. Nothing to do with the studio. Personal? Like what? Uh, Nothing to do with James, right? It is to do with James. I knew it. If it's to do with James, I gotta help out as best I can. Come, let's sit down. What? OK. Come on. You're Jiley. You love James, and James loves you. You guys are legendary. There's nothing that you can't work out without talking to each other. It's what you guys do best. Just follow your heart, talk it out, and you guys will come to some sort of understanding. Oh, that's my phone. Anyway, my ride's here. I got a jet off, so okay. thanks, Riley, again. No. Just follow your heart. It's all cool. <laughs> See you later. Bye. Cooper makes it sound so easy, but I'm so scared to talk to James. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I realize Noah can't possibly be feeling strong and manly in this situation. I wanna show Noah that I can be vulnerable too. After all, we're in this together. Amanda, I'm so sorry. It's okay, I understand. I know you don't want me to see you like this, and I wanted to do something to show you that I get it. By dressing in your pajamas? Well, this is what I look like when I get up in the morning. I don't answer the door like this, or let anyone see me. And I went all the way home, changed, and walked all the way back with those stupid balloons dressed like this. Noah, you know you're always gonna be a warrior to me, no matter what. Well, I like this look of yours. Thanks. Want to watch a movie with me? Sure. Right. What are you watching? Robot Cop 3. That's the best one. That's the one where he gets the robot dog. Yeah. What's in there? It's rib sauce. 
Don't tell the nurse. Ew. Just by the look on his face, I can tell that Noah's feeling a lot better. And that's all I ever wanted to do. I'm calling James right now because I know he's probably sleeping. I'm not ready to tell him what happened, so I hope he doesn't pick up. Hey. Hey. I thought you would be sleeping. Nope. I'm awake. Let's talk. Face to face. This is going to be even harder than I thought. 